three, four, five. Ooh. Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Dani and this is my YouTube channel. <laughs> I know I've been MIA for a little bit, but we're back, we're stronger than ever and we have so many things to talk about. But today the key information that I want to share with you is how to build your staple wardrobe for this autumn. So first and most important piece for me, I think, for not only the autumn, but also spring, a little bit of summer. If you're in the UK, you know the summer is never quite super warm like it is in Europe. So I think your best and most important staple piece, it's obviously gonna be a trench coat. I mean, guys, I know it's a piece of outerwear, but you can wear it with absolutely everything. And the thing is, no one will be like, oh, you're wearing the trench coat again. <laughs> It's literally something that you will wear all the time. This one is obviously my absolute favorite one. It was my dream trench coat um, and I got it as a gift for my birthday from Reese. But um, you can get it in every store nowadays, like even Primark, anywhere you want, you will find the trench coat. Uh, to be honest, they are basically all very similar. So it's just a matter of styling it right and then you are done. I'm gonna try and wear it now, wearing this outfit with my little bloop. <laughs> it's so nice, you can wear it inside, outside, you know, if it's a little bit chilly inside, you can put a little, you know, like, um, how do you call those, the gilets, like the little gilets that are like um, down, like the Uniqlo ones. Also perfect with like a little sweater, you can wear it also just like at the start of winter. It's honestly such a good investment piece. Second piece oversized blazer doesn't have to be beige right i have like a green one too a black one you can have it literally any color that you like or that you really wear so if you wear only black then get it black but this beige one is absolutely super wearable like it has no comparison because you can wear it with absolutely everything any brand again all the brands are doing the same jackets because of an obvious reason that everyone wants to buy them, wants to wear them because they just look so good. And obviously if you're not into oversized stuff, just skip to the next one, but this honestly looks so good. Again, this is the same outfit, but like just to make the point, it looks really nice as like a little over jacket or if you wanna wear it as an actual, you know, cause we're not just modeling around all the time. We need it to be actually useful. Then, there we go, looks super nice. Bam, your little bag, and then you're done. Third piece, a white slash beige sweater. This has been by Lola, but just like any old beige sweater will do. If it's a little bit oversized, like a bit straight here, those are the best ones because you can literally just like make them kind of float around your clothes and you can wear them with so much literally if you buy a sweater like this this style you will wear it all the time not only in the autumn but also in the winter i guarantee you this is literally the sweater that you're gonna see me wearing the most this is just to show you one way of wearing it there are so many ways and if you check my instagram then you'll see actually me wearing it whereas here i'm just i just want to kind of show you how it normally looks so this is the sweater yeah just you know oversized normal basic you're just gonna bring it in a little bit and then you end up with such a cute cute little look again like we're literally building on top of this already built outfit and it's just looking so nice so if you're a bit colder then you just wear this on top of the t-shirt as soon as you get a little bit warm bam thing comes off and then you have a t-shirt on. Fantastic, genius. I am so excited about this though. Like this is my first video in so long and this is, this is my thing. I love this. I'm very intense with like the beige and browns and <laughs> whites. I'm sorry, but it's literally like my favorite tone just for, you know, spring, autumn, obviously summer, it's perfect, but the nicest things that they make are literally these colors lately. So I'm sorry if I'm a bit intense, but I'll show you two of these ones. So I think the next thing 
is obviously a v-neck cardigan. These cardigans are so good with absolutely everything. You can dress them up, you can dress them down, literally you can wear them with like, you know, these jeans and then they'll look very like weekend relaxed. You can wear it, then you can wear your blazer on top or you can wear your trench coat on top and it will just look so nice, so classy with your trainers during the weekend or like some loafers, like low loafers. If you wanna wear it for work with some work trousers and I'll show you later the work trousers that I normally use. Um, this is just so versatile with some like necklaces. And again, you can go to my Instagram also, you'll see loads of looks of how I style things. Um, but honestly, a purchase you definitely have to do. Also guys, before I forget, all the links to the clothes that are either that I'm showing you here or similar things, because some of these things are a little bit older, are gonna be down in the description below and or in my Instagram page, Danny Ritchie, at Danny Ritchie, um, that you can also find in the description. So you can find loads more tips, loads more outfits, links to loads of my clothes, because I have way too many. So things that if you like, then it's easy for you to get them. Okay, let's move on. I think I should have started with this one, let's be honest, but I think we all know what this one is and I think we all have one in our wardrobe, so this is not a surprise for you. And it's a white tee. This specifically, there are two styles that I really like. So you have a little bit more formal one that is this one. So this is like a Zara one. It's a bit, bit of an old one, so they might not have it anymore. But this is more like a knitted, and maybe you can see here the, there you go. A little bit more knitted, a little bit more tight right here so that you can wear it with like um, your work trousers and stuff like that. But then you also have your normal kind of like oversized or like a bit square, T. This one, for example, is from Kos, as you can see here, and it is a little bit of a thicker material, so perfect for autumn or for winter or for spring. Obviously, if you want something more like light for the summer, then any old t-shirt will do, but if you want something really high quality, like these guys are not paying me to say this, like I wish, <laughs> but um, these t-shirts are so so good. I, like, I haven't found any other t-shirt that is like, that the material is so perfect and it doesn't, um, your bra doesn't like um, go through so you can't see it. Like you know how you can see here a little bit of this? With this, nothing guys. Literally super good t-shirt. It's square though so be mindful that again you can have a bit, a bit more of a you know skinny one or this ones are a little bit more flowy if you want to look a little bit more relaxed. Again, Combine it with your blazer, with your trench coat, with some jeans, with some actual trousers, trainers, loafers, ballerinas, whatever you want, guys. Super versatile. Okay, next, our white shirt. This is an oversized one from the Zara, and it is an extra small, because I normally buy extra small things on the top from Zara, because they're normally a bit oversized, and I'm not a massively, like, oversized type of gal, but a good oversized shirt will do miracles. Like it is so trendy, it is so nice. You can wear it with, if you don't wanna look very short, if you're short like me, I'm about, I'm five foot four. So if you don't wanna look super short with your jeans and then your shirt, like it's out, um, then you wanna wear a little bit of heel. But otherwise, again, with low first trainers, whatever you want, Literally, you can wear this weekend in, weekend out. You can even wear it for work if you wanna like just tuck it in a little bit at the front. I've done it, looks fantastic. And now we go to the bottoms. I think the first one, an obvious one, is this one, the one that I'm wearing right now. And these are just a pair of straight jeans. These are super high waist, these are from Abercrombie. Um, and I see, think they still have it on the web page. These are really nice, they're not, super wide because I'm not, I don't like like super wide baggy jeans. They are absolutely perfect. You can see that they're a little bit more tight here. So it's good for like a tight fit. You can wear it also with your oversized shirts, with your blazers, everything. They're just so versatile. I absolutely love these. Like they are worth the investment also. But again, you don't need to spend loads of money. They're gonna be not that difficult to find anywhere. Just look for some straight jeans, high waist, straight jeans, and the wash that you like. This clear one, the, like this um, lighter one I really like, but if you like a darker one, then, you know, be my guest. And then 
if you want to go a little bit more to like formal wear or also weekend wear, something that you can wear for a bit of both, it's going to be the obvious pleated skirt. <laughs> this is a new one from Mango from the new collection, which you can find in the web page and obviously in the link below. But this is like a really, let me see if I can show you. There you go. The pleats are here. It's like a knitted one, this one. It can be knit. They have a lot of like different models right now. This one particularly has like a, like a big thing here. And so it's good to like wear it and then wear it with your belt. And I'll, I'll show it here. So you can wear it again with like a t-shirt and your blazer on top. You can wear it with some tights and some ballerinas for work. You can wear it with some like um, high boots or over the knee boots or your kind of halfway boots. The ones that I normally have are, you know, mid, mid height. Um, they look so good. And it's something that because it's knitted, you can take through to the winter and then you can still use it. I just wanted to show you, just in case you like a different length, is your pleated skirt, but on like a midi length. So this one goes, you know, underneath the knees and like almost kind of halfway through your shin. Um, and this is literally a lifesaver for me. Summer, winter, autumn, spring. This is my absolute favorite skirt. And last but not least, guys, the high waist trousers. They're perfect for work, for weekend, for anything that you want. And they don't need to be necessarily black. Black is like my favorite color to, to dress on. Um, and blue and white. I mean, I have a lot of favorite colors to dress in. But these black ones are just very, like I've said a million times during this video, versatile. Everything that I'm showing you here, it just works well together with each other. Like... You can just create, like I said, your capsule wardrobe with this and just wear these things on repeat. Um, these ones are from Zara. So you probably know about them. They're the high-waisted ones that everyone talks about. And I'm going to be honest, guys, the hype is real. Like, I'm not even kidding. They look so good. And they might not look good to everyone. But for people like me who have like a little bit of hips, a t uh, like a thin, more of like a slimmer waist here but a little bit more hips here and a little bit like of, of you know me on the legs these are so nice I'm gonna be honest I had to get them fixed because Zara makes things very long for very tall people I'm five foot four like I said before and I had to fix them a little bit but Zara makes the same trouser in like the same size in completely different lengths and like shapes it's really weird but Top tip, if you go to Zara, never try just one pair of trousers. Just grab a couple of the same size and go in and try them out. I'll stop blabbing now. Thank you so much for watching this if you've made it this far. Congratulations. I hope it was really useful to you. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe and send me a comment if you have any questions. Honestly, I'm always answering my comments. So just please feel free to drop something in the box below, even just to say hi. Don't forget to also visit my Instagram at Danny Ricci, which you can find also in the description. Give me a like, give me a follow, save some posts if they're useful to you. Tell me what you want me to talk about next because I'm always happy to take on suggestions because it helps me just, you know, see what is useful to you. So yeah, I really appreciate you watching the video, guys. Have a good one. Take care. See you soon.